Hi all. Today I would like to share my um, junk journal for um, the theme is Sherlock Holmes that I bought this one from Dream Etc. I really love her design and this junk journal book I'm going to create and make this one for my friend and she is not like a crafter but um, she would like to give you a try and do some journaling for her son which is um, her son name is Indy so I hope that she will like this so this one I tied this um to make um, all my journal very tight because it's very bulky and the size of this one I think is about let me check is 8 by 6 I just fold the A4 paper size to half and then most, most of the paper that I use in this project are coffee dye and I use like brown envelope, brown paper and all ephemera, some tags and I hope she likes it so this one is the cover I just um, fussy cut the mystery and then I will put a glossy accent on each of one and this one I also fussy cut and put like um, attached with the um, hot chipboard to make it more give like more dimension and also this one a little note here and it say here Chola and this one I use a Coptic um, binding is about egg signature and here is the cover and look how bulky it is and that it didn't even put anything yet so and this is the back with a lot of gear and Sherlock home the printable that I print out are uh, printed um, are from the laser printer because I don't want um, any I mean <coughs> the co I, want, I want like the color very to uh, I don't know it's too early for me like white brand or something okay this is um the inside look and you will see this one is a wax brown wax thread that I use it and buy this book and this is um every signature has like um a pattern design so she can put like cover with her son picture or just leave it like that so I will have to go very fast and the coffee dye paper I use here is about um, 120 grams and this is um, the brown small envelope I use to stamp off Tim Holes. it say to be all that possible we must attempt the impossible to be all that live can be we must dream of be more and inside I create a pocket and a little journal say mystery the small book I print off in small book and buy just like sewing in and out okay this one is also um, a pocket and some this one is my own design I'm doing like a traveler pass like Paris and also <clears throat> this one in a month and it's double size I print in double size and also some note tag I think this one I print like some free printable I um, most of the free printable I just um, check on the Pinterest which there's a lot of inspiration there I love this the designs I don't want to cover anything and yeah I use the brown envelope <clears throat> and just fold in half to make like a pocket and and this is um the clips and also some little drawing and also like brown this the brown tag I, mean, I love this one I bought something from SA and then they sent to me with the stamp so I just keep it I think it's very nice and this one um, it's a tag she can do a journaling here because I use a hot chip board to glue it and this one is also um, a Sherlock home I just put like a clip on so she can do anything 
she likes here. Look at the design of the paper. I mean, um, trimester try is so, so good with the design of the paper. I like this one. It's magnifier glass. So she can do with journaling or she wanted to leave it like that. Okay. The blank paper, I think, is about 100 page. This is the tag that I also everything attached with a card chipboard to make it more stiff. And this one like um, a tea dye. And I use some tapes, some of um, the paper because when I use a coffee dry, my hand is quite high when I take it off. So it just like tear a little bit. So I use um, a washi tape. And this one is also a bra pocket with a little journal. So I can smell coffee from here. I love it. It's, I'm like a coffee lover. So um, yeah, I think I smell like very nice. And it's also stamped from Tim Holtz with this one. This one I just um print. I think it's like some news, so I just make it a hole. So um, back back and forth, I just put a clip attached to it. And here another um, washi tape on the brown paper. Like it's coming out like this. It look a bit old, but I'm not sure that um, my friend will tear it or not. But it look nice for me. Okay. So um yeah it, all everything is very simple. This one is from um a note card that I bought in a local craft store. And also I attach this one. Um she can do this one anything she like. Maybe she just um attach with her sun picture here and or anything. It's kind of free from. And this is um the envelope. Inside here is some kind of gear so you can attach and put her sun photo here or yeah it's leave it up to her or she can put any note here I like it this one I think um I use some um after my paper is dry I use some tea to spray it also this is a little note I'm really had a lot of fun. This is my first time to do um, the coffee dye paper and yeah, I think I'm addicted to it. And this is my first album that I'm doing um, like how big for the junk journal. And I think I will do it more <laughs> with this kind of um, Sherlock Holmes. This is this time is going to be on my own journal as I want to keep it because I do a lot of journal from time to time but um, most of the time I do a journaling when I travel but now I just like um, not travel much as before because due to maybe a lot of work and many things to do so yeah and um, after like came back from work so that's nothing much to write just, um, just like a routine thing and mystery and this one is also um, a little note saying confidential so she can put um, her son photo here or maybe here or on every page just give her some idea because she is a um, non crafter she might surprise oh what should I do with this one <laughs> so I will tell her more and this is more tag And this is um, also a clip and something attached. Yeah, that's very fast. And there you go. I hope you like it. Give me some comments or um, if you want me to make this one like a custom made, just email me. Okay, have a good one. Bye bye.